Hello Pisces, it's my lady from my lady's way Terry, and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading from October 9th through the 16th, 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. I want to thank everybody for like, share, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. If you'd like a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, let's get this show on the road. Check your sun, moon, rising signs. I, I don't think I said that. All right, let's go. All right. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Pisces, love reading. Pisces, love reading. Pisces, love reading. October 9th through 16th, 2017. Pisces. All right, so it seems like somebody might be invading your personal space or you may be doing this to someone else. It seems like whoever this person is invading the personal space, they coming in and out and in and out and in and out. You know, they're not just like a stick around person, you know. All right. So, wow. Okay, so this person is also using you to get ahead. They're using you. Okay. Jesus. Like, I mean, I don't like it either. All these negative reading this. But, I mean, I try to channel the strongest energy and this is what is coming out. But it seems like whatever this situation, it was meant to happen this way. You know, it, it, but it's not looking too good for it. You know, you're waiting for this person to come back because you love them. Or this could be the other way around. They're waiting for you to come back because they love you. But this is not meant to be. Okay. Okay, it seems like every time they come back, they come and they bring you gifts and stuff, you know. Just so you can... I mean, it could be gifts. It just could be things. Or just them coming to you could be a gift. You know, but they do that to settle you down. And then next thing you know, off again. But it seems like they might be taking you into a negative place mentally. I feel like you might be going crazy over the fact that, like, where are you going? What are you doing? You know, why can't I talk to you? Ugh. Okay, so it seems like, yeah, of course, we know this from this whole situation that you really care about this situation. You really love this person, and that's why you're dealing with it, and that's why, you know, is you're going into a dark place trying to think about what's going on, you know, but then it's like this person is basically disrespecting you when they come to you, and they are using you for little things, you know. But you love them. You really care about them. And I feel like in most, most, it might be a new relationship also. It's like you're trying to get this person to love you. I don't feel like, yeah, I don't feel like this is something that's been going on for years. Okay. All right. So it seems like this person may work with you. Okay, and they're saying that they may be an ex, or maybe they work with your ex or something like that. Or it could be your friends are trying to, or some people you work with are trying to protect you from this person because they know of their past, okay? All right, what's going on with the Pisces? Pisces, Pisces love reading for 10, 9 through 16, October 10th. No, October 9th through 16th, October 9th through 16th, 2017. Love reading, love reading, love reading, love reading, October. 9th through 16th, 2017, love reading. Whew. 
sorry. I'm just hoping it changes into something else, you know. But it's like no matter what I do, the stuff it still come out the same, no matter what. But it seems like somebody is hoping for somebody to communicate their love to them. Okay. It seems like if at, at first you could have felt like that y'all had something, like something was great. Okay, yeah, this is the Pisces. But it, now it seems like you're just wondering, like, you know, what is this? Is this real? Or this could be your partner thinking this about you or the person that you're dealing with. So to me, this makes me feel like it was too much drama and somebody didn't want to fight anymore. Like somebody felt like they always had to fight for love and they don't want to fight anymore. Okay, but now it seems like they're trying to work hard on this one. So, all right. So, this could be some kind of work love affair. Okay. All right, let's see. We got the Eight of Cups. Eight of Cups. And this is upright and it says... It may be time to move on and start new plans. Do not let your pride stop you from making the change. So it's like, you want to leave this situation, but you don't feel like you'll find anything better. You know? It's like I put all my cups in here. I don't want to go anywhere else. All right, so we got the Ten of Cups. It says, your attention should be on your home and peace in your home. It is time to balance peace and harmony in your home. So it's basically to me, this is like this person coming over disrespecting your own area, you know, and then and you, I feel like you need to just focus on yourself, get yourself grounded and get yourself back to where you're supposed to be mentally because I feel like you need to get yourself out of this dark place this person has sent you to, you know. All right, so we got the nine of staffs. Staff, staff, staff. Reversed. And this says, as a result product of lack of planning, movement will be painful and draining with little time for rest. I feel like with this relationship, as soon as y'all got together, you just was like trying to let it ride. Like, let's see what this turns into. And then now it's turning to somebody just coming in and out and not wanting a commitment. And you just like, what the heck did I do? You know, I've been working hard to get this person to see me as a great person, but they just seeing me how they see me. They don't see me as somebody who wants something more. They just felt like I just want a, a time to time, you know? All right, so we got the Eight of Coins. Eight of coins, eight of coins, eight of coin. And it is upright. All right. So it says, you may find yourself learning a new trade in which you will find economic stability. Seek opportunities which specialize in knowledge and learning. To me, this makes me feel like you have been. I don't feel like you're about to get rid of this situation. You're going to keep living in it. But either you have or you're about to get ready to start up. Um, just start something like a new project. I mean, like planning weddings or something. Just so you can um, take your mind off this person being gone all the time. But you're about to start just working to make your maybe even start a new job just to keep your mind off this person being gone to to make the time pass okay so then we got the three of coins it says mm, it's mm, it may take some time to get what you want there will be much need for work and skill to succeed so this is saying that your plan just may work with you sitting and waiting for this person to do the right thing and be with you. But it's going to take a while 
Ooh. I'm saying at least eight months. Eight months, but it could be eight years. I only say that because I see a lot of eights on the board. And eight is working hard. So, um, hopefully that helped you out. That's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you're on a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, have a wonderful week.